Hi, my name is Russ. I'm going to show you this uh, Node-RED software that I just started playing with, and it's pretty cool. You can do a lot with uh, IoT devices, um, and I, I thought I'd try it with uh, uh, Trigger CMD, and it, it was super simple. Um, so if you want to try it out, the easiest way is to use Docker, if you, especially if you're familiar with Docker, uh, but most people run it on a Raspberry Pi. Um, but it, if you want to do this Docker quick start, you just copy that command and run it and it'll it'll download the docker image if it doesn't already have it and just run the uh, uh the, the node red instance and it gives you the url you just paste that into your browser and you got a running node red instance um so a quick easy flow is just to put a you know this inject uh uh i don't know what you call these things inject thing on your uh, flow and um, that just kind of gets it start gets a flow started and I'm gonna put a HTTP request on there and then connect these two together um, and then I got to configure this HTTP request um, <clears throat> now you could use the trigger CMD API uh, that would allow you to like actually send stuff that came from the previous step into it like as a parameter to your command, uh, but I'm just gonna basically run the command, and that's adequate for most people. So I figure I'll, I'll just do that. Um, first of all, let me test my command. It's just I'm gonna run Notepad or Notepad2, whatever. It ran. Oops. Um, and now I can use this bookmark uh, link and just copy that and paste it into the URL portion of this you know, HTTP request configuration just click done and then deploy it and now I can just test it boom it ran uh, notepad via trigger CMD um, and yeah and that's that's basically it if you want to um, do like I said more than look into the uh, the API uh, for trigger CMD um, it'll give you the option to actually you know run notepad for instance with a uh, with a parameter but and that's all I got. Uh, thanks for watching.